This is Peter at iWatch Security in Raleigh, North Carolina. We're going to do a quick tutorial on how to change batteries in wireless smoke detectors and other life safety devices that you may have in your home. Starting off with the Interlogix most recent model of smoke detector, the, there are no batteries um, that can be removed from this. They have a life of 10 years per the manufacturer. Therefore, when the batteries do go low, um, then it is time to replace the smoke detector or 10 years, whichever one comes first. When it comes to the newer version, excuse me, when it comes to the older version of the Interlogix, also known as GE, smoke detector you will um, rotate counterclockwise keep that mounted to the wall there's a battery kind of door there you can use the ribbon to pop those out or a tool like a flathead screwdriver to get those out they are two CR123A batteries that go in the same direction so when you take those out and replace them with fresh new ones the uh, positive will be to the right sliding the door back on making sure it somewhat clips into place because that does need to be out of the way for the case to come back together when putting it back up on your wall or ceiling there is an arrow there and a tab at the top or you know, one side of the smoke detector, having those in the same general direction, maybe sometimes you will have to rotate well, uh, right or left, clockwise, counterclockwise, and then clockwise to lock it back into place, and that's nice and secure. This is a Qualsys smoke detector, however, the carbon monoxide detector looks somewhat similar. The two tabs do line up counterclockwise to unlock and there are three AAA batteries on that. They can be popped out and replaced. Uh, these are a little more snug and might require a small flathead screwdriver to get those out. And then back into place by hand. Going the negative side first and pot of positive side back in. Once you've replaced those three AAA batteries, the two tabs will line up and lock by turning uh, clockwise. Lastly, as an example here, we've got a, a firefighter which will be next to a smoke detector that is pre-existing in your home. This is an audio device listening out for that smoke detector to go off. There's a small tab here where you can rotate the, um, the cover. It uses a CR123A battery which goes in one particular direction only. Slide it back in negative side first towards the spring and pop that in. There are two tabs on the cover that will go in on on the bottom there and lock back into place you can remove this from the wall or ceiling or wherever it might be located most likely on the ceiling to so you can change out that battery or just swap it out while it's still mounted thank you for watching this is peter at iwatch security in raleigh north carolina This is Peter at iWatch Security in Raleigh, North Carolina. We're going to go over a quick tutorial on how to change out batteries on these particular door or window sensors.